Hello everyone, I wanted to talk about the Intex Explorer K2 Kayak. This is a two-person inflatable kayak that I do like, but I do have one issue with it that I'm gonna talk about in a little bit. This kayak comes with two seats, two oars and a pump, and some patches. This is a good beginner pot kayak to use for fishing, to get on a lake, to get on a creek. I would consider this an entry-level kayak. It's at 10 feet, three inches. It says it can hold up to 400 pounds up to two people, and it's three foot wide. It does come with puncture resistant vinyl, it's three separate air chambers, which is good. And it does have some Boston valves, which help it inflate and deflate very quickly. So this kayak is good because it can fit in the back of your car. It comes with two seats, which are pretty comfortable for a beginner kind of kayak. And you can maneuver it on a lake, in a creek, in a river. Fairly good for beginner kayak. It does come with a skeg, which helps you cape somewhat straight when you're paddling. This is a great beginner kayak to get you out on the water, to get you some experience, the outdoors, spend some time on the water, and get a feel for what a kayak could be. Now, this kayak is good in terms of the beginner stages. It's not gonna to compare to an advanced kayak. It has a lot of good reviews on Amazon. Now, my only issue with this for the price is one thing, and that is the squeeze valves. It comes with some Boston valves, which are easy to inflate and deflate, but the squeeze valves that it has are hard to deflate. So if you wanna get on the water, you can inflate it fairly quickly, and it does a good job of maneuvering and helping you stay afloat for fishing or sightseeing or anything like that on top of the water. But when you come to the point where you want to wrap it up for the day and deflate it, some of the valves are fairly cheap and it's these easy squeeze valves. So to deflate it, you're gonna to have to take some extra time and squeeze the valves and try and figure out a way to roll it up and deflate at the same time or have somebody lay on it and deflate it. It's not an easy task. That is my only issue with it. But other than that, this is a great entry level kayak. The seats are fairly comfortable. It's gonna keep you on top of that water. You're gonna be able to maneuver it for fishing, or just getting from point A to point B. Pretty happy with this for the price. And you can store a lot of stuff on it. It has the grip handles on both ends, and it does have a removable skeg. So the skeg helps you stay kind of more on a straight line when you're paddling. Just one note, when you use that skeg, it's hard to keep that kayak on dry ground because that skeg's gonna fold over. So be careful about that. I'm happy with this purchase. This is a nice kayak to get you outdoors, to get you some kayaking experience on top of the water. If you wanna go fishing, if you wanna see the sights while you're on a lake or a river, this is a great introductory kayak and I'm happy with that. My only issue again is the cheap squeeze valves that it has to try and deflate them. But I would say Intex did a good job with this introductory Explorer K2 kayak. I would recommend this for somebody that wants to get into kayaking and wants to experience kayaking on the water. I hope this review was helpful. Thanks for watching.